All this month, get up to $50 off any Android smartphone from Appalachian Wireless. Any Android you desire. All $50 off with two-year agreement. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless and East Kentucky Network Company. Prosecuting and defense attorneys have different outlooks on many legal issues. This includes whether or not suspected criminals are getting reasonable bonds. From a legal perspective, it doesn't matter whether I think people deserve a reasonable bond because the Kentucky Constitution explicitly provides that everyone charged with a crime in Kentucky is entitled to a reasonable bond. I think a lot of times people fail to distinguish between a bond and a final sentencing. Bradley says taxpayers are paying a heavy price over the reasonable bond issue. The whole country is suddenly realizing that we are spending a ridiculous amount of money to keep people locked up. So a lot of uh, state governments are stepping back and saying, okay, how can we lower uh, incarceration costs because it's breaking us up and we can't afford it. Every tax dollar that our county puts into our jail, we're taking away resources from law enforcement, um, EMS services, volunteer fire departments. Although there's a financial consequence for taxpayers, Bradley says there are others who pay a price. Now let me tell you who the real victims here are. It is it's the people that are sitting over there in the Floyd County Detention Center right now, presumptively innocent because they have not been convicted of anything yet. But I have seen people sit in jail for seven, eight months for a charge that they have not been convicted of, over $250. As a defense attorney, I can tell you that I feel this way and my clients feel this way. We feel like we are guilty until proven innocent. Okay? That's not fair. Tomorrow, we'll hear from the prosecution's perspective as we speak with Floyd County Commonwealth's attorney, Brent Turner. Reporting from Prestonsburg, I'm Sean Allen for EKB News.